Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. In this video, I'm going to share to you a tutorial on how to create stroke or outline to your text and picture in Canva. So, uh, here I've already added a picture and also text here. I'm going to do uh, for the picture first. So, if you want to create stroke or outline to pictures, you can just click on the picture. Uh, I've already removed the background, so if you haven't, you can just click the picture and then remove the background first. And then when you're done, go to the, in the edit image again and then find the shadows option and choose glow. This one. And then as you can see, there's some shadow or outline that you can use to make it more obvious. You can just adjust the effects and I'm going to change the shadow colors or the outline into white. And then I'm going to make the size bigger so it will become more obvious. And you can also adjust the transparency here like this and there's also a blur option that you can use like this so I think that's enough and when you're done you can just uh, click anywhere and it will be safe automatically safe like this and to make uh, the uh, stroke in text you can also click the text and you can just click on effects and you'll find the splash option here as you can see there is some stroke and out at the attack so I'm going to change the can just change it as you like and to change the outline you can just change the phone like this so easy you can do this uh, in many fonts uh, option going to choose the red one and change a default like this and then I'm going to make it the same like this so you can do this with any fonts. This is a uh, three different fonts. You can you can also make some adjustment. You can the thickness, the offset, or the direction like this, and so the direction you can just adjust it as you like. Okay, so that is how you can create a stroke in. Uh, to picture and also text in Canva. I hope this video is helpful to you. Don't forget to click like, leave a comment, and also subscribe our channel. See you guys in the next tutorial. Bye-bye!